my implants. Think they've got the upper hand. Show them what it means to mess with the Republic and the Eternal Alliance. Stay safe.
forces, concentrate fire on the imp vanguard. Live. The imps are strong, but our defenses are stronger. Imp artillery incoming, brace yourselves! Exceeding specifications. The imps are on the run. Take no prisoners. Reporting for duty. That'll teach the imps, Gum. Honored, Commander. Glad to see you back fighting for the Republic. Theron, you're looking good, son. Combat suits you. And small talk doesn't. What's the latest? Well, our base is secured and the Empire's finest are running home to their Empress. Not bad for our first battle as allies. Asina's weakened. If we retaliate now, she won't have time to recover. A solid strategy. If I know the Empress, she's already planning her next offensive. We suffered heavy losses. The survivors await your command. Malcolm and his new ally are no doubt gloating over their presumed victory. You compiled the Alliance Commander's psych profile. What is your recommendation? He is a battle-hardened champion, surrounded by allies and bolstered by the Eternal Fleet. Only an unexpected blow will pierce his armor. Then we will endeavor to surprise the Alliance Commander. Gather your top engineers and rally the troops. I'm coming to Ayakath. What are we looking at? The imps are holed up in their base. Defenses are heavy, but they're not equipped for a prolonged offensive. With our combined armies, we can lay siege to Asina's base and suffocate her war effort. Asina didn't climb to the top of the Sith Empire by being a fool. If we give her enough time, she'll find a way out. Then we hit her hard and fast. Crack the base wide open and stop the imps in their tracks. It's our best shot, and that's why Asina will be expecting it.
She'll ambush us the second we enter the base. We'll be trapped inside, running blind, and locked in the Empire's sights. We need something the Empire won't expect. Like an arsenal of Iocat's deadliest weapons. That'll change the playing field. Lucky for us, my scouts found a weapon stockpile nearby. Droid resistance is heavy, but if we breach the factory and grab the munitions, we'll have enough firepower to level the imp base. Ambush or not. Good work, Malcolm. Now I know how you've survived so many battles. Well, I didn't get these scars by playing it safe. Coordinate with Lana and get ready to attack the base. Theron and I will take the weapons factory. Você viu? Você viu? Commander, Malcolm briefed me on your plan to seize the weapon stockpile. Commander, I've received a transmission. I'm it's heavily encoded, but it appears to be from Scorpio. She says only the gods can give us back full control of the Eternal Fleet. 
As to what that means, your guess is as good as mine. Is that what I think it is? One of Iocast's original creators. It looks like it's been dead for centuries. And let's hope it stays that way. Even all this time later, I can still feel the agony of its final moments. Something horrible happened here. Thanks for the nightmare, Father. All right, buddy. Let's see what you know about these weapons. What a magnificent world. Even blemished by ruin. And soon it will belong to the Empire. The apparatus is almost complete. Unfortunately, the fragmented data has caused a few minor setbacks. I expect it to be fully operational within the hour. No excuses. Yes, Empress. Victory is almost upon us. Soon our enemies will lie in ruin, and glory will be restored to the Sith Empire. Jack. Ah. 
I'd say that's enough firepower to give Asina a run for her money. Download every last file. We need to know how to use these weapons and how to build more of them. Give me one minute. Well, that's odd. Some of these files have already been decrypted and translated into basic. We might have Scorpio to thank. If she's listening, I wouldn't mind the temperature getting bumped up a few degrees. No? All right, well, I can't blame a guy for trying. Huh. This place used to be the super weapons control room. Looks like our crispy friend here was the last one to use it. Over a millennia ago. Can you control the super weapon from here? <sighs> Looks like I'm shut out. When it went on lockdown, it must have closed all outside access. Looks like Iocath's creators were fighting a civil war. One side built the weapon, but something went wrong. The super weapon's more dangerous than we thought. It wiped out all life on this planet. What kind of weapon wipes out an entire species and leaves the droids to tend house? Maybe a bioweapon? Sentient programming? I'm not sure. Only one thing's for certain. According to this data, it was tested on four different planets before Iocath. All successful. Over 10 trillion lives gone. This isn't a weapon. It's the apocalypse. A weapon that powerful can't be trusted with anyone. Not even the Eternal Alliance. We need to find and dismantle it piece by piece. The sooner the better. There. I've downloaded arsenal blueprints, fusion matrices, everything our army needs to gear up with the latest and greatest Iocath weaponry. Now, let's get out of here before... ...that happens. Commander, we've received your intel. I'm dispatching teams to secure the rest of the weaponry. Meet me at Malcolm's base. It's about time we take the fight to the Empire. I'll see you there. And I have something to discuss once you arrive. Lana, out.
Commander, we need to talk. Time's short, Lana. What's on your mind? I've been thinking. How did the Empire, the Republic, and the Eternal Alliance all find the superweapon within minutes of each other? The timing's too perfect. It can't be a coincidence. Exactly. We were acting on intel from an anonymous source. And it turns out so was the Republic. What's your point? I cross-referenced both sets of data and they're identical. I'm confident the Empire received the same intel. Whoever tipped us off wanted everyone to clash over the superweapon. They wanted to start a galactic war. Who benefits from starting a war? Could it be Asena? Or Malcolm? We can't rule anyone out. The Shroud would normally be a suspect, but we've already cracked that mystery. And then there's Darth Jadis, or a rogue agent inside the Republic SIS. Let's not rule out Sith intelligence. The point is, there are too many suspects to count. Find me a name. I'm on it, Commander. Commander, meet the Nova Strider. She's outfitted with the Iocath tech you recovered. Should be a worthy ride to help you lead our charge against the Empire. I can think of no better way to face the tide of our enemies. May it stand as strong as our alliance. Incoming call. Empress Asina, have you called to surrender? On the contrary, Commander. While you were gallivanting across Iacath, my engineers discovered a back door into the superweapon. Once they've gained access, we will turn the weapon against you and win this war for the Empire. You have no idea what you're dealing with, Asina. That superweapon wiped out all life on Iocath. If you turn it on, you risk killing everyone here. Even you. What other choice do I have? This weapon is all that stands between the Empire's survival and being obliterated by your eternal fleet. This isn't a game, Asina. If you activate that weapon, thousands will die. But I'll save millions of Imperials from the fury of the Eternal Fleet. Surely that's a cause worthy of sacrifice, Agent Benico. Good day, Commander. If we move quickly, we can stop Asina before she activates the superweapon. The walker is yours, Commander. Lead us to victory!
It's not your time. Disengaged. Agent Sean, you're just in time. From this seat, I will harness the power of Iacoth's super weapon and lay waste to your eternal alliance. Step away from the throne, and you can end this war right now. Oh, I will end this war in spectacular fashion. Witness the last gasp of your pathetic alliance. Asina, no! It's beautiful. I see a radiant empire, infused with the Force, built by the Molten Gods. They're gracing me with the super weapon's power. It belongs to the Sith Empire. That weapon killed an entire species for trying to harness its power. If you think you're in control, think again. You are blind to the truth. No! The gates are closing! The throne is rejecting your input. You've lost your hold on the superweapon. No! I can still see it. I know what I must do. They are coming! Come 
Commander. You were right. I've awakened the gods. Nothing can stop them. You're wrong, Asina. Whatever you woke up, I'll find a way to stop them. No, Commander. Soon, you will join me in death. I have to admit, I respected her. For Sith. On the bright side, that power flux knocked out the super weapon's defenses. And killed the signal that put our ships in lockdown. The Eternal Fleet's back online. It's about time. Commander, I'm detecting massive power spikes at the super weapon facility. Let me guess. That's bad. More like catastrophic. The weapon core is charging and no one's at the controls. If you don't deactivate it soon, it may obliterate the entire planet. Don't worry, Lana. We'll handle the super weapon. You'll never reach it in time. Hold on. With the shields down, I can remotely slice into the mainframe from here. Maybe buy you enough time to manually kill the weapon at the source. Do whatever it takes. In the meantime, tell our forces to take shelter. Be safe. Both of you. You too, Commander. Eternal Fleet, move into position and charge all forward batteries. It's time to knock out a super weapon. Sir, live.
Darren, I've reached the super weapon facility. How do I shut it down? You'll need to interface with the main controls. Look for a throne, take a seat, and hope for the best. I've seen two thrones on Iocath, and both were occupied by dead bodies. I don't want to be the third. I've seen it cut corners, but you'll be sitting on the real deal. Let's hope that's good enough. Time's running out. Hurry! rebuild. Who would try to destroy me? One, mark my anger. Pain. Hope eroding. The betrayer lured you to Iocath. Ignited war. Spark the engines of rage. Envy. Passion. Hate. Sorrow. The betrayer now offers you Sacrifice Prime! You! For the Six Gods! This doesn't have to end in violence. Calm down, and let's talk this through. There is only rage. Commander, you're safe. I found the superweapon. It was a giant droid. I know. You've been talking in your sleep. I almost had to stuff a sock in your mouth. Whatever that droid is, you knocked it out of commission with the Eternal Fleet. Now it's recharging and gearing up for a counterattack. Which is why we must strike soon. Hesitate too long and the Titan may destroy us all. The droid was obsessed with rage. If we're going to destroy it, we may need to keep it calm. Or push it over the edge. That's good to know. We need every advantage we can get. Too bad the droid's the least of our worries. Someone sabotaged the throne while you were plugged in. Any chance you saw them? No. But the droid said it was the same person who lured us to Iocath. Someone close to me. The conspiracy cuts deeper than we imagined. Sounds like an inside job, all right. 
Only a handful of people could get close enough to sabotage the throne. Who could have done such a thing? You're my spy master, Lana. No one's better positioned to stick a blade between my ribs. Well, I'm glad that's out in the open. If Lana's under suspicion, you better add me to the lineup. I am the better spy, after all. How kind of you, Theron. Then there's Malcolm, Ego, Visla, Satil, the entire Alliance army. Whoever it is, I want them rooted out. Quickly. There's only one solution. You must monitor everyone. Hold on, Minister of Paranoia. You can't invade everyone's privacy to sniff out a single rat. I can't, but the Commander can. Give the order and I'll begin surveillance of everyone, even Theron and myself. It's the only way to flush out the traitor. I won't let one traitor turn me against my followers. They've earned my trust. I'm glad someone hasn't lost their mind. Trust is a risk. Now more than ever. Commander! I knew you'd pull through, and back in fighting shape no less. I hope you're ready to return to the front lines. We struck down Empress Asina and stopped the apocalypse. I'd say we've earned a moment to celebrate. I'll drink to that, but don't celebrate too hard. We need you back on the battlefield. You won a major victory by neutralizing Asina, but the Empire refuses to surrender. They're still fighting tooth and nail for control of Iokath. They're still desperate to claim the superweapon. If we take it first, they'll have no choice but to surrender. Then that's where we set our sights. But we can't stop there. We need to keep hammering the Empire. Day by day, hour by hour, only then will we win this war. Now if you'll excuse me, the battlefield's calling my name. I'll see you on the front lines. We'll track his movements, see what he's hiding. I'll promise you right now, whoever this traitor is, we will find them. And we'll make them pay. I know you will. While you start searching, I'm going to win the war they started. For the Eternal Alliance. May the Force serve us all.